Okay, an update on Hurricane Barrel. It is still a major hurricane, Category 4. Now, would we talk about weakening in the coming days? It's relative. This is still a major hurricane. It's not going to weaken drastically enough where it's no big deal. This is a huge deal, an extremely powerful storm headed, really taking aim at Jamaica for tomorrow. Tomorrow, Jamaica is kind of the hot spot of getting the brunt of the storm. We do have tropical storm conditions moving through Hispaniola later on today and right now, and a little bit of rain but a lot of rain and those higher winds will be potentially moving through Jamaica tomorrow. So we are going to see the storm continue to weaken. One, it has some wind shear, but two, there are some high mountains in Jamaica that could help start to weaken the storm a bit. The change with the forecast is the aim at the Yucatan. It's kind of Honing in here on the Yucatan instead of farther south near Belize, but also staying a little bit stronger, potentially at Category 1. It will run into another environment just before the Yucatan of nice uh, conditions for storms. Not for us, because we don't want these storms to stay on the stronger side. So it runs into all this wind shear, goes through the land interaction with Jamaica. It's not a huge land interaction, but it's some. And then it goes into an environment with low wind shear again so that could maintain its strength especially if it doesn't get ripped up too much in the coming days and then make it way as a category one into the yucatan just south of cancun then it has all that land interaction and once it returns into water it will have a hard time maintaining any strength or getting stronger before making another landfall in other parts of mexico or into southern parts of Texas. So it's not going to be a problem for us, but it is still going to be a huge storm uh, moving through the Caribbean that we'll keep our eye on for you. In the meantime